<clears throat> Good morning, Astro Gang. So, it was the Grammys yesterday, correct? February, what, 10th? I didn't watch it. I never do. Uh, sometimes I check it out. I make sure I stay educated with who won that, blah, 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 that. But I don't watch it. Point but that's not the point. That's not what I want to speak to you about today. What I found interesting, another guy, uh, J-Hop1, he posted... And um, he was touching on it's funny how people support and root for these people who win these Grammys, but then you have real heroes in your life and you don't support them. And I've been thinking about this the last couple of months. Like it's just been on my brain. I'm not salty, it's just facts. And it's very interesting because those are solid facts. First of all, I don't want to take away from the celebrities in the world. That's amazing. I love what they're doing. It's motivating. It's inspiring. It's beautiful. And they're humans and they're living their life. And that's their job. That's their careers. And that's a blessing. They're making good money. Also, shout out to Cardi B. But I must say Nipsey Hustle Victory Lap. That album was fire. But I am a Cardi B fan. Like, I love her music. But that Victory Lap was lit. So congratulations to everybody who win and didn't win because if you made it to the grammys even if you didn't win but you were still nominated that's a w so it doesn't matter but i want to touch on the subject how people will push celebrities and push people they don't know but they have real time real life celebrities heroes philanthropists entrepreneurs in their circle in their family day to day and they want like a simple photo they won't share a simple event we got to stop doing that. We have to think globally. You have to stop thinking so small and stop that crabs in the bucket mentality. You may not look at it like that, but I bet many of y'all tuned in last night to the Grammys. I'm sure you did. You tuned in, but you won't even take a minute to watch your homeboy ad that's running on Facebook. Or you won't link your home and your LinkedIn. It doesn't make any sense. Like, if you're eating, the people around you have to eat. Because if there are people around you not eating, you're truly not eating. At least not at the level you could be eating if you were paying it for it and networking and investing in the others around you. Like, we have to do better. You got to stop pushing that. Like, people quit to say, oh, the rich keep the rich and the poor. No. Today's time, how this works, we've seen it. You can see somebody building up their algorithms, building up their content, being consistent on these social media. Next week, they're in a the movie. Blame it on Quay, prime example. Everybody just saw him doing his videos, doing his videos. Now he on tour with Tyler Perry. Funny Mike, he was doing his videos, videos. Now he about to be in the movie. The hookup too. Like, come on, man. Gotta do better. There's nothing wrong with it, I'm just saying. Okay, yeah, it's not a problem, but be, be part of the solution. Why not? Why not help your local business owner? Why not? It's free. It's a like. It's a share. It's that easy. Even your enemies like it. If you genuinely like the picture, but you don't like that person, so what? Like it. Share it. Post it. Screenshot it. Come on. Tell somebody about it. I was at the terrain race yesterday. I end up speaking about the fellow business people, my entrepreneurs in my life, people I've collaborated with. It just comes out naturally. You know, like, that's just how it happens. Like, you can't expect for your business to flourish, but you're not investing in anybody else's. Like, it's free. I'm not asking you to invest in their stocks. If you don't believe in it. If you don't believe in what they're pushing, by all means, don't like it. But we're talking about a simple like. Y'all not watching these people taking the time. It's so overlooked now because there's so much technology and you got your little gifts and all this, you know, marketing digital editing but if somebody take the time to create some content that they believe that is helpful informative or entertaining if you enjoy it why not just let them know it's easy it's free but y'all will go toe to toe fall out with your real life friends over two people that you don't know now, don't get me wrong i have the people i look up to the celebrities that's what they're here for but i don't know them i never forget that i don't know them I never forget that their money is not my money. And I never forget the real hero and celebrities in my life. I never forget the Ella DeGeneres, the Dwayne Johnsons, the Kevin Hart's in my life. Like, and I make sure they know that. Anybody who I admire since I was a little girl to now, they know that. Some way or form. They know that. I don't have to say it. It's how I move. It's my actions. It's what I do. I'm just saying, speak highly of the people in your life. It's cool having a favorite, you know, idolizing this from that one. But you have it right here in real time. Come on, man. You got to wake up. 
I'm pretty sure the Grammys are beautiful, but come on, you done dedicated what? Maybe maybe two hours? I haven't watched a show like that in a minute. BET, I stopped all of it. Not even on purpose. I just I don't have time. I rarely watch TV as it is. I like Netflix. I have my specific shows and I tailor my time. Even when I was younger, my mom gave me certain time frames to watch TV and I appreciate that. Like, it's discipline. I'm just saying, I'm not gonna sit and watch a bunch of people in a whole room. And it's not doing nothing for me and mine. That's just where I'm at right now. But the least you can do is support your friends and family if you believe in what they pushing. Come on, man. Like, that don't make no sense. Like, get with it. I'm just saying. So that's the moral of the story today. Like, it's nice. We all have the people we look up to. But you don't know them. Get a grip. Do not be watching the whole Grammys or whole music videos. Every time this artist or this producer drop a new video but then your family drops something and you don't like it it's just whack you can't do that you could do it but you should all right this has been ashanti stroman ceo of god to the green i'm out